Um, <clears throat> so this one here, basically behind this wall, this garage door in this factory, uh, that is the Princess Highway. Now I am, this is an artist studio, actually very cool artist studio. Um, she is an Archibald prize winner. And uh, that's one of the reasons why I wanted to do this video because there's some cool stuff on the wall. So there's four artists that live here. Well, two live here, um, renters, but the um, you know, others, uh, they come and go. But they've got one internet service, right? You can see it's coming in here. It's fibre to the node. So it means it's crappy. Um, we've told them to apply for a fibre upgrade, so hopefully they can do that. But <clears throat> I'll walk you through the scenario. So as you can see, coming through here, you know, some pretty cool art. So this is their studio where they work out of. I don't know if any of you are into art, you might recognize some of these people. But this is the, um, the one who's the uh, famous artist down here, her studio's down here. I really like that. That's mad. But so this uh, this here is a st another street, right? So there's another factory door. So they're basically two factories that are connected. So they originally had um, an Optus cable service here, um, <clears throat> but outside. They covered over the pits. Um, they'd done some work on the footpath and just could not get into the pits. There's concrete over the, all the pit lids and stuff. So, yeah, <laughs> there was no way of doing it. And to try and get, because it's um, that separate address, it's just to get MBN to come out here and to do all that and coordinate with council. And it just would have been like a six month to a year process and, you know, it's MBN's notoriously bad at that type of stuff. So what I suggested is because they've got one router, let's run some data cables back to there and then stick on a couple of um, Wi-Fi routers. And then, um, so there's another person who lives upstairs, right? So this is the one studio here where we're gonna be putting in one router. And then there's another person she sort of is upstairs. Um, so through that door and there's some stairs and it goes up there. So I started running into cables yesterday. I'm back here today to finish it off. But sort of, yeah, it was quite tricky because as you can see, there's so much stuff and you have to move stuff out of the way everywhere to get the cables in. The ceiling's relatively high. You might be able to see my cables up there. So then I'm going to stick on a couple of these, one for the lady living upstairs and another one for um, the artist, which I won't mention a name. So if you can guess, put it in the comments. But this is where I'm at. So now I've still got my two cables here. So I'm running Cat 6As because they're actually quite long runs. It's about 100 uh, metres in total. So I'm running these guys here so we've got some cat 6a and then I run those back back to here and then we're going to put a couple of little cat 6 sockets say on this wall something like that and then they can just plug into the switch at the back here and then we're going to get them to apply for fiber upgrade because um, there's a pit just out the front here um, and get them to put a fibre box here where they'll have four separate services and then and after that everyone can have their own separate services so the routers and the cables and everything I'm using they'll be able to reuse everything it's not like once they upgrade um, all the work I've done is void so the tricky part I'm going to have today is getting from this side 
through here uh, and to over here. So I'll be playing around with that this morning and get that done. But anyway, I just wanted to uh, basically show you this cool place I'm working in today. Um, as you can see, there's mad art. They're really nice people, really chill. Um, yeah, so there you go. Hey guys, it's uh, Jason here from Securicom. So if you're in need of some internet help, um, whether that is uh, getting a fault fixed up like a bridge tap or you have some sort of an issue on your MBN service, or maybe you need to have some new cabling and sockets installed, um, we provide a range of services to help you out. There'll be some links underneath this video um, and you can click on those links and I'll take you through to our website where you can book my service. All right, thank you very much. Goodbye.